Here at the Daftas, we don't believe that the greatest artists are Picasso or Van Gogh, or that you have to die before you're truly appreciated. No, we are honoring the best of the offbeat artists this year in the 2010 Daftas. The nominees are 9,852 Slice Toast Portrait. An artist decided to create a portrait of his mother-in-law for her 50th birthday out of toast. It took six hours and 600 loaves of bread. Working Hoverboard takes art back to the future. A French artist made Back to the Future a little closer to the present when he created a working hoverboard. It can't support body weight, but man, does it look cool. Artist throws works by Damien Hirst in a bin. Artist Michael Landy made his art by destroying someone else's and to the tune of several thousand dollars per piece. New York Subway gets etiquette lesson. An artist installed a series of etiquette posters in subways, covering everything from groping passengers to smelly food. Tate Modern filled with porcelain sunflower seeds. An artist filled Tate Modern's Turbine Hall with 100 million handmade porcelain sunflower seeds to represent the Chinese Cultural Revolution. Cardiff Street Bollards hide artworks. An exhibition in Cardiff City Center went mostly unnoticed. It could only be seen if someone pressed their face against the road bollards. They can't all be winners though, so the winner of the 2010 DAFTA's Offbeat Art Award is the Giant Toast Portrait. 9,852 slices later, you've got a DAFTIS award, and hopefully not a mother-in-law who's really tired of toast.